Hello, my name is David Cherry, and what I want to show you is how to get the last row ID from your database if you're using a MySQL database or a Maria database uh, without doing an insert. Now, this could be important for uh, you know several reasons. Uh, one is is like if you want to know what the last ID is, you can get the last ID you know to what the database is which is the first you know reason of course you know that's the first reason but the number of inserts may not match the total number of rows so this will be handy you know when you get more knowledgeable uh, using my SQLI or the Maria database or dealing with inserts and stuff like that on how to determine you know is the number of inserts equal to the actual rows within the database okay so that's basically what I'm trying to get at and so anyway um, the the code here as you can see this is the code here all right that I that I have here and you know how I am I don't type things out I just give you the code and let you work with the code I think that's a lot faster and quicker you know it doesn't waste time I, I go through a basic explanation okay and the output of the code will look like this okay so here in my SQL I get last row ID okay it's object oriented format okay and so you know it tells you that my last insert is 241 okay now let's go back right here to the code okay and I'll explain the code real quick and I'll provide a link where you can actually view the code copy and paste the code you know for your purposes uh, to help you out okay uh, this is for a demo database here okay which will be uh, you, you know as I have it for a demo okay and the uh, database table is users okay and you don't have to put 3306 here okay when you're dealing on a local host but when you do have a port number there that might be a, a reason because you might have uh, MySQL operating on different ports okay and so you know that's why I leave the 3306 there to remind me and this is the standard port right here and you know so you know I'll just leave it at that you know you know for now okay and here's your connection string right here okay this is how you connect a database okay now the most important thing to understand uh, and, and I'm only going through highlights of certain things is this line right here okay all right and the reason this is important most important is to realize that you have to do order by ID okay and this you know describes you know you know descending okay and you want to have especially limit one Otherwise, without that, if you don't copy this line exactly, okay, you know, then <coughs> you're going to have trouble. So anyway, this is the basic code right here, and I just wanted to show it to you, and I'm going to uh, bring it all the way up here where you can see it, and look at it, and copy it, or you can go to the web URL that I post uh, in the video description. So anyway, this is the basic code how to fetch the last ID without doing an insert. You know, a lot of people have been trying to figure that out. I've noticed it over the years. And so I just wanted to provide the code for a quick reference, you know, uh, for you and, uh, and a link to the web URL uh, that you can actually see it as well. So anyway, this is David Cherry, a quick tip for uh, MySQL database programming. And I just wish you have a good day. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you like the code and like the way I do it. Uh, please leave me some comments and uh, refer me to others. You know, so just want to say thank you for everything and uh, have a very, very good day. This is David Cherry, your host.